I'm here to discuss the annexation of the property um, owned by what I understand one owner. And I question on why the annexation was even put into the uh, thoughts of you all. I wonder if the citizens had an opportunity to even discuss the need for annexation is one point. And then another point is um, I just spoke to Claremont County's Commissioner Painter for quite a long time, about two hours ago, and he shared with me that that property for, de for decades, he thought, uh, was in a, a holding spot that was more agricultural consortium kind of um, usage of that property and that the, the landowner, you know, wanted that and that they were good with that, they didn't have any problem with that and it was, it was good for that property to be like that for, for years or I thought he said years. So anyway, so I question why this landowner is searching and seeking out I guess it was my understanding that it's the landowner's right to go to other places to change um, uh, his ability to possibly sell the land. And so I question when that happened, how that happened, and I would assume that the landowner came to you all, some of you all, and discussed the possibility of changing the type of annexation that you need as uh, that is being proposed um, that you think you all need. So that goes back, then that, then um, I wonder then, did anybody know about the possibility of this one landowner coming to you all and discussing this possible annexation that we all weren't even knowledgeable that you all thought it was good for us all. So I um, know that the, con the, um, the annexation is an expedited annexation. That means that, I don't know, there's seven different parts of the annexation and I know that it is literally sitting on the commissioners, uh, Claremont County's commissioners and authority to sign. It's, it is going to be a done deal because you all have made it be that way at this point without um, us having an opportunity to intervene through quite a bit of uh, processes to get to this point. And I was also told, told that when it gets to an expedited aspect that the public is not required that you all are not required to allow the public to come in and talk about that part of the um, annexation. So honestly, what I'm asking you all is to literally show us this contract, to print out a duplicate of this contract, and to renege it, to stop it, to pull it back. and. I think that if you all choose not to do that, I think that there should be hundreds of people to go to Claremont County and to wait for, it's supposed to be on the table at 10 or 11 a.m. tomorrow, and just to show that we do not support this type of process from the very beginning of why you all even thought that that area needed to be annexed into our area. So that's what I think. Thank you for listening.